Here come the Blaze North. They'll leave off by late for Ferrara. Back to Venus with a great chance. Oh, off the outside of the post. Ross Venus early. Having the best chance of the night. And just grazing the iron on the way past. Good look from the Blaze on that trailer play. That one comes to Ferrara at the blue line. Ferrara plays it back to Robinson. Oh, a really nice chance stopped by Bounds. Really good look for uh, Brett Robinson. That is probably the biggest stop of the night from the Cardiff netminder. Yeah, it really is quite a good stop from Ben Bounds. Standing tall on this breakaway. Look, nice bit of speed there. Luke Ferrara gets the puck, manages to thread it just in front of Brett Robinson. who can take it in full steam. Gets straight on Ben Bounds square, but he stays nice and tall. Makes a good stop. And we get an offensive face-off for the Coventry Blaze. Dingle sends one ahead of Adam Corshane. Corshane in, shoots himself, goes five. Oh, Pat save, rebound there for Garrett Ladd. Pokes it over the top of Bounds, who got enough of it to direct it wider than that. Not by much, as the Blaze have had a couple of good looks. Won by the Devils, Paris straight across for the Devils to enter the zone with Hotham. A little cheeky stop and start. Paris, Hotham, Patterson trying to keep Nasty Oaks. Oh, he's free as Hotham shoots one wide of the glove. Martin to the top. Paris, a one-timer! And that's what he does best. Big shot from the number six. And the Devils go one in front with one minute six of five on four to also have in their favour. Really nice move here from Joey Martin, just finds a bit of space for Drew Paris. One-timer rocketed right into the back of Kevin Nastjuk's net. Yeah, I'm just trying to see if any of the Devils took his eyes away here. I think maybe he would have been able to see this. Pope to the half wall, Farina. The Blazer sands one play with the snow stick as Wojtek Klosses is broken. The Devils will continue here. Fournier. There's been a handoff. Bentavolio. Looking into the back door. Chance off the pad of Nastjuk. It's fallen to Bentavolio. And it's under the feet of Wojtek Klaas. And the Blaze are back to full strength with Ryan Dingle. Playing a little sucker. And he's kicked it to Valoran. With Noble in support. Valoran. Big save by Bounds. Valoran went for the rebound. And might have to have a bit of pushing and shoving here. Marco Valoran. He went straight at that rebound. And the linesman will have to separate him and a Cardiff Devil, maybe Farina, I think, in the corner there. Morrissey. Watched by Claus. Claus frees up the puck. Oh, and that one's freed up, though, for the Devils. Crowder! Gets the crowd on its feet! Near side on Nasty, a loose puck on a broken play. And the Cardiff Devils double their money. Yeah, here we see Wojtek Klaus just trying to do a little bit too much with the puck on the right-hand side. And then the puck is made free from Jake Morissette. Paul Crowder just jumps onto it, finds it. It's an excellent shot, but he has got a lot of time and space in front of Kevin Nasty yeah. to really make sure he picks his right spot. just jumped and it might be a breakaway for Morissette. Morissette has his legs under him, it is a breakaway but a backhand is weak and Nastio deals with it easily. The buzzer squeaks but play will continue. Valoran goes board side on Martin, gets through, Valoran himself, oh it's a great individual effort! Valoran splits the difference up this Cardiff Devils lead just as easily as he splits the D. It took something special from the French Canadian. But the Coventry players have maybe found that spark, that bit of magic. Mark, a great finish. Comes out wide, very wide right-hand side. And then just cuts in almost, almost on a right angle. He just comes straight across to the Cardiff defence. And then goes far, far left-hand side as we're looking at it. Past Ben Bounds, keeps the shot down low. Very quick release and finds it to make, cut the deficit to one. As it's Coventry plays one, Cardiff Devils two. Noble sends a pass ahead of Jordan Petrus who will get rid of the icing with a tip in, he'll chase it. 
He might win it here. Oh, just ahead of Venus. Venus has got it though. He pulls it in to Valorand. Oh, he put it wide. Marco Valorand, another glorious chance. And the Devils take a big deep sigh as that was close. Face off won by Coventry now in the corner. Shot through traffic. That was all he hits the outside of the pipe. Chance for Arnolov. He just hacked at it wide. Lowers. Corshane. Arnolov. Arnolov looking for the tip of the outstretched stick of Dingle. And now here come the Cardiff Devils. Crowder pulls up. Oh, a lovely feed in front. Big save, big rebound though. Nasty did enough, but on the back door, no mistake from Lord. And he continues to score big goals at the Sky Dome. As the Devils get that two goal lead back. As the Blaze was struggling here. Yeah, Crowder and Morissette just trying to find something. And then Morissette finds the pass to Lord with Kevin Nastjuk out of position. And Lord very happy with that goal there, as well he might be, as he takes it to being 3 1 to the Cardiff Devils. to Fournier, shoots one through traffic, rebound off the blocker of Nasty up, but the Blaze will come north now with Valorand. Puts the Jets on Valorand, good save by Bounce with the rebound, is there, and Petros has shoveled it in. Workman-like stuff from the captain. He might have been a coal miner in a previous life, the amount he had to dig here, but he got it in the net, and again, Valorand really the architect. Coventry back with him one. Valorand comes in. He takes a quick turn, puts it on his forehand, and it's left. It's all intents and purposes. It looks like he's got it covered, but it slips out. And Petrus is there on the doorstep. They say, digging for coal, digging for gold, and gets the score. It's 3-2 to the Cardiff Devils now. Play starting to get a little bit scrappier again as Paquette under pressure from Farina. Farina barges through. The Devils have a man in front of net as well, which concerned me somewhat, but the Blaze have come north with it now. Ryan Dingle steps in, Dingle shoots, good save from the blocker. Or maybe the shoulder, I should say, of Ben Bounds. It was up high, now here's Ben Tavolio. Ben Tavolio coming north, shoots wide of the net as Farina got absolutely steamrolled by Paquette. And a chance in front for Ben Tavolio! Taken away by Nastiuk. The arm of Hicks is up well and truly. He's going to penalise David Clements here. Well, Hotham had a real poke at Danny Paquette on this shift. You see it there? Yeah, there's a right slash over the arm there as well. I'm a little bit disappointed that Michael Hicks didn't call that. He was looking right at it. The, the penalty on Clements is absolutely fair. Yeah, that's fine. If Hotham wants to go after Paquette and drop the gloves, then so be it. You know, you know that's the way to go about it, to, to take the slash on him after that. In full view of, of the officials there, at some point that's going to cause, cause yourself to get hurt. Three and a half minutes remaining. Blaze all have given that away to Crowder with speed. Crowder pulls the trigger on a weak one. Nastic's dropped a huge rebound and made a big starfish save. Heart in mouth stuff from the Blaze netminder. And he will just look at the ceiling for a moment and think, what if? There, uh, Crowder again finding the puck on his stick, and then again the Blaze struggle to get anywhere. And it, it, it's kind of a, a flopping starfish save as they, they look to roll over. Justin Farina there, I think, on the on the door, just trying to get at, get at the puck. But again, very lucky for Nasik who, who covered that rebound. 